What up everyone? It is vlog day. Who knows? No idea, it's been a while. But we're gonna try this again. Is it focusing on me? I don't know. I don't know, I don't know if it's focusing on me. Anyways, it is Friday, March 3rd. Uh, it is 6.43 in the morning and we're I'm getting up getting the kiddos ready and fed. Uh, fun story. Went to make them waffles and they uh, were frozen, so they just came out either soggy or hard as a rock. Uh, so that was a waste. Now they're eating cereal, so sometimes it just doesn't work out. Uh, anyways, getting them ready for school. We're gonna take them to school, and then I don't know what Clean and I have planned for the day. This is our Friday off, but we'll figure it out. You guys want to say hi real quick? Sure. No. Caesar's like, don't you dare put me on camera. Hey, dude. <laughs> Hi. He's eating his dry cereal because he's a little weirdo, aren't you? No, it's fine. He just likes his cereal dry, and that's cool. All right. All right, lunch is made. Maddox has his peanut PB and J, no crust. Caesar has her two uh, turkey, mini turkey sandwiches, and there's their other stuff. Uh, got my coffee going on. Is this focusing? I don't know if it's focusing. I'm gonna be really mad if it's not focusing. Uh, breakfast is eight. Now we're just doing the brush, brush your teeth and get dressed stuff. I'm about to let this this thing out for the day. Oh, look at that! Getting light already. Just in time for daylight savings, which is awesome. I love daylight savings. So, anyways, that's it. Go. We're going? Yeah. We're on. This is my room. Beautiful little picture. You can come close. You don't have to be all the way over there. And. Okay, come on. Come on. Boom. This is my beautiful blue wall. It's beautiful. I know you love it. And I'm. I'm sad. It's gonna be alright. And this is come on in. Come on in. Don't be shy, girl. It's beautiful. I know you love it. And deal with it. I'm amazing. You're welcome. Okay. This is your room. You're gonna love it, aren't you? And this is your closet. Go on in, girl, don't be shy. <laughs> You're so weird. Come on out, girl. Don't be shy. Tell me when it hits two minutes. This was the man cave. Oh. I was never able to touch those. Never got tall enough. <laughs> it's cool though. I took everything in here. Took so many like stuff in there. Okay, come on down. Are you going to move back up? Because my drink's up here. Cool. Are you still coming? Okay, come on, because I need, I want to get something in. And you're not going to have time. Oh, it's already two. Bye. Hey, girl. Hello. Hey, so yeah. This is the shower. It's look like all my showers in here. Like, yeah. Yeah. What do you want to say, girl? Oh, uh, what? Uh, uh, mm, dab on them. It's so 2017. Before we even watch this video in a couple of years, you're like, oh, that was so 2017. Like, yeah. Stuff. 
let's show you my bathroom. This is my bathroom where I fought with it a lot. Okay, we do not need to know that. <laughs> okay. This is our living room. All over around. Super high up. <laughs> yes. And this is our kitchen. Yo. Hello. Hello. Hey, Dad. My shirt. Did y'all get your videos made? Yeah, we're still. What about the Cadillac? One more look into my room. It was a good room. Trust me, it was. That get me comfy at night when it was cold. I don't even know if you just saw my face, but you know. Yeah. Hold my hangers on here. Ow. So, yeah. Bye, room. Okay, I'm sure I'll do another walkthrough with the kiddos and Kalina when they get back, but I just want to kind of do one. They made one last trip to Goodwill and want to do kind of one last video of the house and the neighborhood. It's a pretty bittersweet day. Uh, we're excited to move on to the next chapter, but we are sad to leave this house. This house meant a lot to us. This neighborhood. I mean, I ran these streets for hundreds and hundreds of miles in this area. And anyways, we, uh, we turn the house back over tomorrow, or we sign the paperwork tomorrow. This is all we have left to get rid of and a little bit of trash inside, but this is, gotta keep reminding myself and ourselves that it's, this isn't our home anymore. Um, it certainly doesn't feel like it, even though it does. Every, every room we walk into is filled with memories and just the smells and sights and stuff that you take for granted when you're living in a house and not planning on leaving it. I know this sounds crazy uh, to, to most people that were sad about leaving this house and are thinking, why did you sell it then? Why are you selling your house if you're so sad about it? And it's because it's just not what we want anymore. We're ready to move on to something else. And this is not it. But it still has a lot of, it holds a fond place in our heart. Um, Caroline spent most of her life here so far. Uh, Kalina stayed at home and helped raise the kids here. And uh, we just have a lot of good memories tied to this house. And so yeah, we're a little bit emotional about leaving it, even though we want to. I know it sounds crazy, but trampoline's gone. All the patio stuff's gone. The fort's gone. Everything's gone. So yeah, we're I'm at the point where we're just kind of ready to be done with it and leave and not have to come back because it it is it is sad being in here with it like this. Because just, you know, a week ago, this was our home and it still looked like our home and, you know, a week, two weeks ago and now it, it's not. Which is fine, it's okay. It's just emotional and ready to be done with these emotions and moving on and excited about what's next and the next step. But, yeah, my closet. Clean this closet. The bathroom. A nice big bathroom and a jacuzzi tub that no one ever took an actual uh, bath in. I think Colleen, uh, Caroline took some baths in there but never used the jacuzzi because it stayed, it was so dirty and hard to clean. Um, the jets. We shoot out 
grossness if you didn't just constantly clean that thing. So it wasn't worth it to us. But it, just kind of wanting to document all this so we have it to come back and look at someday. So I know nobody cares about that corner, but I want to remember these things. I want to come back and have this to watch someday. Our fake stained glass to keep the peeping toms away. Um, under the stairs. Closet, yep. Yup. I don't know what I said yup for cleanest chalkboard where we put all our lists and groceries and to-dos and uh, things we were working on and uh, let's see, Caesar's room with her pink striped wall. It's hard to see, but you know, we did that for her before we moved in. One of the few things we did as far as painting goes in this house. As you can imagine, I never wanted to tackle a big painting project because of that. <laughs> uh, the kiddo's bathroom. Maddox's room with his blue wall and his best view in the house. Yeah, it's such a cool room with this awesome view of everything. The neighborhood and the, the city. And... His closet, he had a little, little bit of a walk-in closet there. And then my room, I spent a lot of time in this room. More room, more time than I probably should have which is part of the reason we're, you know, it's, I think it's good that we're moving on. I don't, I don't need this anymore. This is, this represents my uh, old me before I lost the weight and got active and became much more active in my family's lives. Not that I wasn't active before, but I just wasn't there like I should have been. And a lot of it was to do with this room, but I still think of this room fondly. This was my man cave. And I spent a lot of time in here. I don't even, it doesn't even look like my room right now. I know, again, I know this all sounds crazy. Uh, I think it's, it'll make, make sense to people eventually. I think eventually people will understand why we decided to do this. Or they'll at least have a better understanding of it. But, yeah. Standing up here, clean and eating me. We'd, she'd be down there, I'd be here. Pop my head over and check on her and the kids or whatever while they're watching TV or hanging out in the living room. and. I mean, this is a cool house, it really is. It's a really cool house. I'm glad that we had it for the time that we did, but it's time to move on. It's time for the next step. And I'm trying not to get too crazy emotional here because um, I don't want to be a big cry baby on the floor. But it is, it is a, uh, emotional time for me. But it is emotional. Um, uh, May the 4th be with you. That's for RJ. And our song. I hope they get oh, it right. Star Wars today, too. I hope we but. dance tonight. Anyways, I'll probably let the kids say a little something when they get back. Get it wrong. And, uh, and the season oh, will change good. us new. Be the best I've known. And you tonight. know. Facebook timeline today was that four years ago you. today we, we put the fort up. We if built the fort in this backyard. Were, and literally we took it down today. So that's pretty crazy. It's four years ago to the day. And then on a, a day near today, seven years ago is when we built it at the house on bottom. So this is just something.
something about this time of year. I was like, swimming. And my eyes were dark till you woke me. You told me that opening is yeah. just the start. McKay, I'm gonna miss you. I'm gonna miss you, but I'm excited about the future. I'm excited about the possibility. Now I see whatever's the kingdom close. come. You're the one I want. I know this has been long. To see way. me for all the stupid shit I've times, done. But I just wanted to document. Our song. This was our song. I still see the light. I can't see them. And the crisscross of what is true won't get to us. Cause you know me, I cannot give up on you. Cause you know me, I cannot give up a fight